Hi guys, welcome to a short video about the question how you can activate Google Assistance for a locked phone. So, uh, in the situation you have uh, no screen, no nothing, and then you say, okay, Google, and then a command, uh, and then Google will do whatever you want. I mean, more or less, at least, uh, as long as it can do it. So, this is how to do. It has been really difficult uh, to find something. I have been watching many videos, checked many websites, and I didn't find the solution. So, I tried on my own, and I found the solution. Uh, why do we actually want to have this? I mean, of course, you can use it with a phone alone, but there are a couple of things uh, where you can use the Google Assistant these days. You can use it with some earbuds, headphone, or even with a watch these days. I mean, this watch is really nice. I'll put down the link into the description. It's only $50. And with this uh, smartwatch here, uh, you can really use Google Assistant directly from here, uh, but it only works uh, when you can access Google Assistant through a locked screen and i have seen videos where people are recommending to remove all the fingerprint all the security everything uh, yeah it's definitely not working like this there is a solution i don't know why it's so difficult but here is how it goes yeah, of course first you need the google assistant to go into the settings so just say hey google okay here we are and then you can use the settings here you have to click on the right top here to go into the setting. What you have to activate, as far as I know, that's the voice match here. You click on that and you activate this and maybe you can even train your voice and so on. I, th I think that's more or less here. I mean, you can add device, but it's just for Wi-Fi things. That's not for Bluetooth. Here I'm connected through Bluetooth, so I think that's more or less here. Then the second thing which we have to do is the personalization. That's something which most of the YouTube videos or websites forget. I have turned on everything here. I'm not sure if we have to do everything here. I think the most important thing is the headphones. That's the one thing here at the very bottom. You have to turn this on here. Uh, I'm not sure about that. If it's working for you, maybe, and you think it's too much here, you maybe can deactivate and try if it still works, but that's also very important here. Then you have to go to the settings, like normal settings of your phone, and go to uh, notifications. We have to go down app and notifications and then you have to find the Google, Google Home or Google Assistant. I mean, you can check for all your apps and then search for Google Assistant, but the easiest way is to invoke Google Assistant and then you have it in the last apps here. Usually just go here and then go to notifications and then turn on uh, notifications. I think this is also needed. I'm not 100% sure about that, but I think this is also needed. At least I have turned it on and now it works. I can show you that. Of course, you have to make sure that it's active, that it's connected. Whatever you're using, headphones or your watch, it is connected and active. So I'll put it in active condition here and I turn the thing off and I long press here to activate Google Assistant. Hey Google, tell me a joke. What do you call a gigantic pile of kittens? A mountain. Yeah, that really worked. Yeah, it was really uh, recorded. I mean, it was using the microphone from here and it was using the speaker from here, but it worked through the Google Assistant from the phone and no screen was turned on. I didn't have to unlock with the fingerprint or something like that. This is exactly what I wanted to have. And I think this is also what most people will want to have. Yeah, for me it works and I hope it will work for you too. If you have any questions or comments, just write to the comment section below. I'm always happy to talk about these things. And if you like the video, give me a thumbs up, subscribe my channel. Thanks for watching and see you next time.